Welcome back to Cord Cutters LI, where we help to save you money on your cable bill. Well, with all of the people running from the Amazon Fire TV devices and jumping on the bandwagon for the On 4K Pro streaming device, a lot of people are asking me, can I jailbreak this device? Can I sideload all the apps that I want? And the answer to that is absolutely yes. In fact, with the 32 gigs of internal storage, you can install more apps than you've ever been able to install on any Fire Stick. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to do that step by step. It'll be easy peasy, no must, no fuss, no greasy aftertaste. So if you're ready to learn, I'm ready to show you. Let's go. Okay, so before we get started, I'd like to address the overused word called jailbreaking. That is when you gain root access to your device, like an Android uh, phone, for example, to be able to undo a bunch of restrictions and things that are on the device to allow you to do stuff. There's no need to do that on a device such as the On 4K Pro because really it's just a few settings. And this allows you to sideload. And instead of the word jailbreaking, we prefer to use the word sideload. You can sideload as many apps as you want that aren't available in the Google Play Store. And that's really all this is about. We use the term jailbreaking because that's what people search for in Google, but really the term is sideloading. So to enable sideloading on the On 4K Pro, it's really, really simple. So let's hit the gear on the remote. That's right at the top right and go into the gear. And then we're gonna to wanna to go down to system and then we're gonna go down to about. Then scroll all the way down to the bottom where it says Android TV OS build. Now you're gonna to wanna to hit the select button. That's the one in the middle of the circle. Hit that seven times and watch what happens. As you go, it'll say, you are now three steps away from becoming a developer. You're now two steps away, one step away, and now it says you are now a developer. So that's all you need to do for that step. Now let's move back. Now, if you scroll down, you'll see developer options is on the list and it is enabled and that's the way we want to keep it. So from here, you can go ahead and hit the home button. Now to install apps that aren't available in the Google Play Store, ironically, you need to install an app that is in the Google Play Store and that is called Downloader. And the easiest way to do that is just to use the voice button on the remote and say the word Downloader. You'll see Downloader pop up on the list of apps, and you can go ahead and install it. This will just take a few moments. This is an official app from the Google Play Store. And then you can go ahead and click open. And when you do, you have to click okay on this screen. Now you may or may not get another message telling you or asking you to allow certain permissions. I haven't seen it on this device, but I have seen it on other people's on 4K devices. So if you do see that message, it'll look something like this. Make sure you say allow. If you don't see it, then there's nothing to worry about. Next, we're gonna enter in the short code to a special Cord Cutters LI page where I have an unlimited app store available for you. To do that, you move over to where it says enter a URL or search term or short code. In this case, the short code is 935-782. And then go down and click enter. That's gonna redirect you to the Google TV jailbreak guide on the cordcuttersli.com website, just to make sure that you didn't uh, mis make a mistake while you typed that number. Hold in the select button here and then go down to full screen mode and make it a little easier to navigate around. So you can scroll down, read up a little bit about what, what we're doing here, and then scroll down all the way down towards the bottom of the page where you'll see this big red button and click on that. If you see an ad, you can go ahead and close that. And then go down to this big blue button that says download and go ahead and download that. After it gets downloading, you're gonna see this message. It says for security, it's not allowed to install unknown apps from this source. So just click on settings and then go down and where it says downloader, toggle that to on and click install. 
After the app is installed, you can click on done. And then you can click delete and delete again to regain that space that that installation file took up briefly. And then click home. Now, like any other Google TV device, all of the apps that you install are gonna be in this Your Apps row. And then you can go ahead and open up this app. So here's where you'll find all sorts of apps that you can install in your device. So as I am sure you are aware, streaming laws vary from state to state, from country to country. So I won't be able to go in and show you the complete list of all the applications that you can install in your device. It is up to you to make sure that you're not breaking any of the rules. But as you can see here, there's all sorts of different applications here available for you. This is a good time to mention as well that any of the applications that you install here are third-party applications. And when you use these types of apps, you do wanna make sure that you use a VPN to help you stay connected and protected and to keep your online identity secure. The VPN that I use and recommend is IPVanish. And for a limited time, I think for another week or two, they have the lowest price that I've seen in a very, very long time, all the way down to $2.19 a month. If you wanna go ahead and check that out before you go testing the waters of any of these applications, feel free to check out the link in the description below where you can find the exclusive Cord Cutters I Lie link for this special promotion. So there you go. Everything you need to know on how to jailbreak your on 4K Pro streaming device from Walmart. If you have any questions at all, go ahead and put some comments down below. I'll be glad to answer any of those. And as always, if you enjoyed anything you saw here today, please go ahead and like the video, subscribe to the channel, and as always, share this and all of your favorite Cord Cutters Ally videos with your friends. This not only helps to get my video shown to more people on YouTube, it also helps to support the channel. Thanks for watching.